As the rain moves out, the flash flooding danger still exists, but it's getting better in some areas in and around Austin. And KVU's Tina Shively is live this morning near 12th and Lamar, where we've heard the water was pretty high there earlier. It's now started to kind of recede a bit. Tina, what's it look like at this hour? Yeah, there is a steady rain still coming down out here. No lightning and thunder in quite a while, but still certainly pouring out here in downtown Austin. We're standing right above Shoal Creek. I want to show you what it looks like right now here. You can see it's moving very quickly, and usually there's a beach out here back behind the Shoal Creek Saloon, but right now, not so much. We can see a lot of debris here, a lot of debris swirling all the way along, and you can see out by that tree also, there is quite a bit of debris. We've seen some sticks and things float by in the last little while. Shoal Creek certainly moving quite quickly. Now, the storm team tells us that the whole thing happened this morning about 3 o'clock. That was about the height of the storm when we had 18 feet of water rushing in this creek. So you can just imagine what this scene looks like. And right now, I'm standing up on the patio, now, I wasn't here this morning before the rain came, but kind of an awkwardly placed dumpster here behind me, wouldn't you say? If, wonder if the water actually picked it up and moved it out here. Normally, people sit out here. There are tables and chairs. Also, another thing here, we can see the watermark on this door, the door to the actual saloon here. A big water stain down here on this door. You can see debris and twigs and things trapped in the door jam here, too. So certainly uh, Shoal Creek was not messing around this morning. Very high here, 18 feet. We're told by the storm team that the level right now is at 6 feet and falling, even though the rain continues to come down. Brian, back to you.